Hey everybody, this is Brian from PB Homesteading. You may notice something's missing here. For the mid-sized tent, it's getting shut down for the summer. I've taken all the uh, Vates kale out of here and it's been moved outside, as you'll see in the uh, outdoor video, for the lower deck grow area or lower deck garden boxes slash kale stand, I guess you could call it. But uh, yeah, so we're taking everything, got the timer turned off, everything's put to bed, so that's gonna save our uh, energy usage. And we'll fire it back up this fall when we, uh, so when I start doing my plantings for the uh, fall garden, I'll actually come back in here and I'll start a planting for this bed and get the kale growing inside the indoor tent again because I believe I'm going to keep this tent, uh, this solid bar LED area that I call it, is going to be used for the kales because I really like how the kales don't get too tall. I mean, they, they were getting, like the last week you saw, the uh, the kale was getting pretty close to the base of those lights back there. But over, overall, I like the way that the kale gets an equal amount of light and it stays green. And because, you know, when I was doing the chard, the chard would get too tall too quickly and it would shade out all of the uh, the little plants to keep them from growing up to the same height but the uh, the chard seems to be able to distribute the light a little easier so that's what the uh, update is for the uh, salad bar LED all right I'll talk to you guys again and after this week there probably won't be any more salad bar LED updates until fall all right bye guys